moved into my new place today. Y'all, when I tell you, I've been thugging, okay? Like, I've been living with my mom and my sister. It's me, my mom, my sister, my baby. I mean, because, you know, I two and a half months when I decided to leave, maybe it was two and a half months old, I didn't have anywhere to go. I didn't even have a car. I still don't have a car. Um, I got rid of my car, you know, because, you know, empty promises, whatever. But uh, <laughs> I've been thinking so hard, bitch. Bitch, this has really been the hardest time of my life. And here I am. Because <laughs> I thought somebody, right. Because, yeah. That to say. Don't ever relinquish your independence for a relationship. Follow your dreams, not your boyfriend. A man is not a financial plan. Always have your own things. <laughs> I honestly feel like since this situation, I don't think even if I was married, I can't see myself not having my own house outside of the main house. Like I would just have to have my own space. Maybe that would change with time, who knows. But also, <laughs> it's crazy. Like people... They want to see you fail. Oh, they want to see you fail. When you don't, oh, they have no control over you. They can't do anything. Because all you fucking do is win. My God, this girl's still here? Because <laughs> I thought somebody thought there was good. Yeah, I thought. You thought. We all thought. <laughs> I want to say thank you to the people on all social media platforms that continue. God, don't cry. That, to, uh, mm, that continue to support me because this shit's a fucking privilege to have. I'm so fucking thank. I swear to God, I see the world with a whole different set of eyes now. I really do. Thank you for the people who continue to support me despite the fuckery that I've had to endure after being lied on. Thank you to my real friends and my family that aren't yes men that have my fucking back. Because that's about the only reason I have some of my sanity. <laughs> Just thank you. And thank you for, to the universe for redirection. Thank God I didn't get what I thought I wanted. Because, okay, I'll take a few months of disappointment over a lifetime of disappointment. I forgot to add. Leave after the first lie you know people can change but they rarely do when people are lying about what they're lying about ain't no fixing that ain't no coming back from that bro <laughs> that's how you rock it if that's how you rock and i ain't rolling last thing a lot of people are afraid to leave relationships fear of missing out like oh i built this person up you know, no one else is going to reap the benefits. Uh, I don't want to start over. I'm scared. Oh, my God. Who's going to want me? Especially as a mom. Because, you know, fucking moms, we're just shamed for everything. No one's going to want to be with you to have a kid, you know? There's just fear of le leaving. Fear of just looking stupid. The only time you look stupid is when you allow yourself to look stupid. You don't look stupid when something doesn't work out. And, bitch, you've had enough. It do or it not even doesn't even have to be, I had enough. It's... This doesn't work for me. We are not a match. We are not a vibrational match. And I'm going to be on my way. If anything, I'm smart, bitch. Because I don't have time to waste. My energy is sacred and I treat it as such.